Um, <laughs> anyways, um, hello guys, what's up? Hey sweeties, hello sweethearts, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Like, I'm actually so 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 excited for this video. And if you guys are a returning subscriber, good guys, ne, nang kafisa, good, you guys drive me mad, you guys. I don't know what to do with you guys because you guys are amazing like thank you so much for pulling through guys thank you so much for sharing thank you for liking thank you for commenting i see you guys down in the description in the comment box like i see you guys and i thank you like galibana like resort like we're here like see sweetie so let me get into this video already because um i'm so excited i just want to get it in and i want to get it filmed and recorded so here we go today i am giving you something so beneficial like if i saw this i don't want to watch it again and again i would want to re-watch it i would want to download it good for you guys um my content has no copyright on music so you can download it and you can watch it later can and you can watch it later so I got you covered sis i got you covered but regardless um today's um topic is um i'm gonna share a couple of things that changed my life like i'm not even trying to actually at this point i'm kind of like making it underwhelming because these things are they changed my life they literally changed the course of my life so i am gonna go ahead and start because this intro is like two minutes and okay if there is only one thing that you get from this video this is what you need to get this is the end like if you stop here please stop <laughs> you need to see the rest because it's also really really great but if you stop here this is all kind of you need to know just to get you a bit further because this is something that has literally turned my life upside down it has turned my life around not that i was going down a bad path but i was going down a path where i was compromising the value of things because i didn't believe that i deserved it so with that being said honey sweetheart baby girl you need to believe that you deserve it all right what do i mean by this i have come to realize that nane i deserve a happy life i deserve a stress-free life i deserve a life where i have everything in order where everything that i do is in my control obviously not everything can be in my control but what i'm saying is i believe now and it took me so long to get to this point because for a long time i didn't really believe i deserved much and it kind of shows in how i was treating myself how i was talking to myself my academics my relationships with people you need to believe that you deserve it like you need a i don't know how to get it into your head it's very controversial i could say because usually people say you need to work hard to deserve something but i found with myself that um in my case i needed to first believe that i deserved it and therefore that resulted in me wanting to get that because i believe hold on no guys i deserve this so i'm gonna work for it because i deserve it not the other way around which is i have to work for it then i'll deserve it do you understand what i'm saying this works for me i don't know it's a backward thinking but it works for me okay so number two i don't know about you guys i keep it but i feel like my life as a lady i know this is fine my life as a lady would be a lot easier if i was making a lot less decisions decisions if i was making a lot less decisions and this is why i highly highly i top tier i highly recommend that you set systems for your life so this is also i feel like this whole video is going to be in me in me in me because this is all good advice that I have kind of learned from my own life and I would love to share with you guys um having set systems gives you less room for stress because you have a routine an example is working out and I have never hey 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 we are now we were before 
this you were never really good friends i used to be so inconsistent and with my youtube channel as well i used to be so inconsistent i'd like post once and what three six months later post again and now i think you're gonna start seeing it baby girl setting systems i think i even have my diary here oh yeah i do i literally i put it in my diary i was like today let me show you today we are filming a video and we're filming this video so um setting systems gives you less stress it kind of sets you up for the week because when it comes to exercising for me there are days where i honestly feel like i don't want to do it because but because i have set the system of okay this is my routine i wake up i brush my teeth do my bed all the cute stuff and i immediately get into my workout clothes that puts me in a mood of wanting to do it and even if i do stay till like 5 p.m in those workout clothes i know what i okay i am gonna get it done regardless because i am wearing these clothes i am used to the system it's a habit now and no matter how much i don't want to do it i am gonna do it if that makes sense okay guys this is also very 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 girl you look cute important this is important i believe that you are a result of the people you surround yourself with this is actually that i think i link down the study but it says the five top people that you spend the most time around not the five top people you like the most the five top people that you spend most of your time around is you oh, that doesn't make sense you are a sum of the five top people that you surround yourself with so it is very important to see who is in your views who's in your size who's in your circle who is in your energy who's in your space because that can really influence you um thank the lord i have been graced with amazing friends all my life but i have come across people who were kind of like sketch like the vibe and the energies weren't really amazing and we could have had a chance of being really good friends but because i value my energy that's another point because i value my energy and i value myself and i know what it i can pick up habits from other people like dude you sit around friends you kind of pick up on their lingo it happens and it can happen with bigger stuff that are more important that are not as amazing so you really really do want to look out for that and you do want to make sure that you're surrounding yourself with good people who have the same goals as you if not better because that is gonna motivate you to do even better and i think it's a really really good point a big thing that has changed my life is letting go of regret and this has done so much for me because i get so used to holding on to my past and i can't really walk into my present and into my future with my past in mind like i used to beat myself up so much about the smallest things like the smallest things the something i said to like someone like seven years ago and i'd be like oh my gosh did they think that was me did blah 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 like and there are other bigger 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 things um that people tend to regret like maybe not studying enough in high school not doing sports in high school not um making friends with a certain person and i believe Jorge, regretting only holds you back from being the person you could be because you're so stuck in who you used to be and all the things that you've done that you can't focus on what you need to do right here right now and it's really unfortunate that we allow this to happen because first of all it's in the past there's nothing we can do about it there's nothing we can change about it but the good thing about it is that we can obviously look back and reflect and we can choose to make better decisions choose to make better choices surround ourselves with better people and kind of like use it as a learning curve because that is what life is life is a series of lessons and a series of fun and it shouldn't be holding you back like your past should not be holding you back and be you know what it is you know how it is okay we're down to 11 minutes okay cool guys 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 you will get yourself out of so many situations with this one tip and this is deciding where you're gonna let your energy go and deciding what deserves your energy like there's so many places and there's so many situations where i could have 
fought someone where I could have given someone too much of my attention because I didn't know where my energy lies or I didn't really know how to collect myself like guys everyone is going to want access to your energy that is life that is life and you need to realize Jorge, you're not supposed to go to every party that you're invited to you don't have to um you're not supposed to go to every single event that you're invited to whether it be a fight whether it be an argument girl keep your peace i feel like that is such a power move as well like knowing where your energy lies that is such like having that kind of self-control and you're like no girl this does not deserve my energy this doesn't deserve me so i'm not gonna put myself in between that like that that will make your life so peaceful trust me guys i'm in peace i don't wanna like if someone comes at me which is very rare am i doing something wrong i don't know it's very rare but like if you're trying to come at me and you got this funny energy like i'm just gonna look at you and be like okay you're like screaming you're shouting i'm not even here like what are you doing it for like sis all right are we good like do you hear what i'm trying to say do you is it soaking in i might be talking fast but that's because i'm so excited and i want you guys to like hear what i have to say like I have a lot to say okay so this is something that I recently started doing and this is about like what month is it About like two three months ago right so I haven't always had a really good and positive um, self-image and I realized Jorge, some days I'm really like yes girl you're the one like you're amazing you're cute and whatever like you deserve everything but then there are days where I'm just like yo what's going on like what's gucci um and those are the days where i need to go hardest at this and this is being good at personal self-talk and that is hyping yourself up um talking to like i literally i go to the mirror what i, I dude you're the one like dude my girl guys if you live with me or if you ever live with me you might hear me doing this sometime and I do this a lot when I don't feel my best because I know how to oh it's actually kind of like a study thing where water actually listens um you can try this with um plants and you can have two of the same plants treat them in the same kind of condition have like a bad word written on one and a good word written on another and speak to them accordingly and you will see like how long did it take I don't remember how long it took but nature actually listens water listens and we are like what 77 percent made out of water so obviously we are going to listen to that too like our subconscious is listening to everything we're saying whether we actually soak it in on purpose or not you are listening to yourself so girl if you need a boost in self-confidence eh, this works baby girl you're the best like you shouldn't be talking to yourself like that like you are the best like i love you so much and i love you in every shape you come in i love you at every way to these bed judges we're gonna love them we're gonna love them regardless because they are part of you okay that's getting emotional <laughs> but we're gonna love you <laughs> we're gonna love you anyway and it literally performs magic i don't even know how to explain it okay guys so this one ties in with the first point and this is giving yourself good food and exercising and this i can literally relate to every single point because <laughs> like the moment that i realized that i deserve better and i deserve to speak nice to myself and i deserve all the good things i also wanted to do that for my body like the more i realized how much i deserve everything i started to do more for it like i started working out just looking great and keep in mind that this is like not the main point like me looking great was like a product of me actually taking care of myself and showing up for myself and doing good for myself because i realized what a big girl this is a temple this is the only life you have and this is the only body you have and you're gonna enjoy it 
well he have it and you're gonna treat it right because baby girl this is your home you can't be treating everyone else right but not yourself uh, so yeah that is something i think is worth um coming up on this i'm just gonna work down on my notes just so okay guys so the last and final point for this video is that you need to stop comparing yourself this changed my life big time like the moment i zoomed in on my own life i stayed in my lane i hate that term because i can go wherever i want to go but the moment i actually took time and looked at my own stuff i realized Hore, i didn't really have time to look at other people's things like i know it's so easy to um look at what everyone else is doing because it's constantly in my face like but um comparing yourself is the thief of joy it's the thief of progress because first of all you're not even comparing yourself to yourself let's start there you should be comparing yourself to your past self and be um kind of like seeing the progress in your life because it's your life you shouldn't be um comparing yourself to someone who's completely different from you how am i talking so fast guys i'm sorry you shouldn't be comparing yourself to someone who first of all grew up in a completely different setting as you you didn't even get born in the same month so tell me how you're gonna start comparing i mean i know it's natural it's natural but the moment you decide what to know i'm not gonna carry on doing this i'm not gonna keep on comparing myself to someone who is not myself because that just doesn't make sense and it took me a while to realize that because it's most natural to compare like and most of the times when we do compare it's either we're going way above in terms of we are comparing people who we feel are lower than us or we go way below and we like put ourselves down and neither of those are really good although yeah neither of those are really good because that kind of like puts you at a state of arrogance and also a state of self-pity in a way i don't want to make this video too long i'm gonna stop it here but i have so much more advice for you guys like if you want me to i can make a part two just let me know holler and i will be on it because i have a whole list of things that have changed maybe ever and i am so excited to let you guys know because i feel like this like guys like i have leveled up I have leveled up and I'm so happy with my progress and I don't see myself stopping anytime soon and I, I'm just taking myself so seriously now and it's not like in a, oh my gosh you have so much pressure now it's like a yes girl let's take it slow let's do this right and I don't know let's love on yourself so um I am done with this video I will see you in the next one if you guys do want a part two like I said I will more than boiling to do that i had to think about that i'm more than willing to do that and uh, obviously guys don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe don't forget to comment don't forget to share this guys your friends need to see this your homies need to see this like everyone needs to see this because this is a very beneficial video like it's good content it's me it's you it's everybody it's amazing peace out i will see you no, 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 I wanted to. You know what? <laughs> Bye.